Hello my people and welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to be dry aging this beautiful rebuy cap that we have here. This is a prime rebuy cap guys. As you can see it's looking beautiful, it's looking amazing and I think this is going to be a nice beautiful thing to do for you guys so let's get into it. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to pat it dry as much as we can. You don't have to go crazy with it. In the bag it says that you can leave some moist in there, no problem at all. And today for this method we're going to use the my bags. And just to be clear, I haven't been paid for anybody to say anything about these things. This is not a sponsored video. So we're going to follow the recommendations and we're going to get this beautiful piece of meat all the way back into the bag. I know it sounds similar, but that's my accent. And we're going to make sure that we take all the air out of it. For that matter, we're going to use this vacuum sealer that we have here right now. And this is going to be the ultimate way of doing it, guys. When you buy the bags, they come with these little strips that you're supposed to put right on the border. And you're supposed to seal everything right on top of this little strip. Apparently this helps with the humidity and... The problem is that that appears in the instructions and we're going to follow the instructions here, guys. We are not going to waste a lot of time and then this thing goes just spoil for no reason and that's not the point. We're going to make this right and we're going to make it good. So let's follow the instructions. I know you don't like to follow the instructions, but that's the way it is. Well, silly, make sure you help it up a little bit. Push a little bit of air out. You know, it's, it's just a little help for this little guy. And here you have it. Everything is being sealed. Everything is being looking good. Now we're going to put it on top of a little grill. We don't want this piece of meat touching any section on the fridge. And we're going to put it on the fridge. This is going to be the longest 40 days that I'm going to be waiting for. But I think it's going to be worth it. <music> And after 40 days, let's take a look at this baby. Oh my goodness, this is looking more like the mummy than anything else. Look at that. I think we're going to be losing a lot of meat out of this steak. Hmm. Let's get into it. And yes, that's all we have left. We lose a lot of meat on this process, guys. We lose a lot of meat. We lose almost 50% of the meat. In the other hand, we have these beautiful colors. The reds are deep and the fat, you can see it through the whole meat. I'm gonna be seasoning this steak with salt and pepper, and that's gonna be pretty much it. I really want to taste, and I really want to know if this was worth it or not. Well, guys, there you have it. Okay. 
40 days of waiting. 40 days of waiting. Mm -hmm. I mean, and I cook a little bit more than what I usually do because it was 40 days there and it's a thin cut. So I was a little worried. You know, I cook it up a little bit more. It's like medium well, almost well. But I remember when that came home, it was like this. We lose at least 50% of the meat, yes. Wow. We lose a lot of meat in there. Okay. But still really juicy inside. It, it looks really good. I mean, it's a matter of giving it a try and see if it's worth it. Right now, it's not worth it for me. There is only one way to know, guys. Let's give it a try and see what happens. Let's give it a try. Right, let me have the... Let's give it a good try. It's really... It's really tender. It's really juicy. Okay. I mean, you know, I'm in the middle there. I don't know. You can see it cuts like oh. nothing. Oh, yeah. Look at that. <laughs> it cuts like water. Shh. Georgie, always so, desperate. Let's give it a good try, Miss Ninja. Let's do it. Okay. Let's see. Let's go for it. Mm. Let's go. Cheers, guys. Oh, wow. I love the smell. Oh, man. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, Miss Ninja. Man. No. <laughs> guys, I have to tell you right now, I cannot wait any longer. This steak is amazing. This steak is good. This steak is delicious, brother. Yes, it is. Wow. You know what? Wow. All right. Uh, I mean, guys, it's a long wait. We waste a lot of meat, but the taste. Oh, my God. This cow came from Mars or something like that, man. This is not a regular <laughs> cow, guys. This is amazing. This is really good. Really tender. Beefy is an understatement. This is strong beef. It does. And it's really juicy. So. And not only that, you know what it does? It literally intensify the fat, the intramuscular fat. When you bite on it, man, you can feel the difference in between fibers and between the fat. It's really good, guys. This is really different. It has I mean, a very nutty flavor. Yeah, the flavor lingers in your mouth it a does. lot. When the flavor lingers in your mouth and goes out of your nose, that's what we call umami. It is intense, the umami flavor. Very guys. intense. It's really good. I don't know if I would recommend it. You know, it's a long wait. We wasted a lot of meat, but the result is impressive. It is impressive. The flavor, it's it amazing. It is impressive. Impressive. The crust in between the fiber in the middle. It, it, I mean, you oh. can, when you bite in it, it has different layers of it. It's really good. I just think that probably oh for this, goodness. you need a big, big, big piece of um, cut, a different type of cut, isn't it? What? Remember the rewind cap video, I had to re-upload it because for some reason we lose uh, we lose a video on YouTube. Mm -hmm. So I re-uploaded it. But the first time that we uploaded the video, everybody was asking, can you dry age that beef? Of course, I had it in my mind. It was a thin cut. I knew what was going to happen. I knew we were going to lose a lot of meat. But I gave it a try, you know? And it is amazing, tender, Tasty. Oh my God. I, I, I don't know what else to say the, about this thing. It's great. The texture. It's amazing. I still have the flavor of that little piece in my mouth. It's super strong. But again, I don't know if I would recommend this thing. You know, <laughs> I, I, it, it hurts my heart. Throw away all that meat. It really hurts me. You know, it's not something that I take lightly. I love it. I cook it a little bit more, but the crust outside is amazing. It's kind of toasty. Perfect. It's real good, guys. I mean, wow. I think for the experience, it's worth it. I mean, you can say, you know, I tried dry eight ribeye cap. Ooh. Yeah, but the thing is, I don't, I don't know if, if it's recommendable, you know. You guys tell me in the comments. What do you think about this thing? Would you do it? Yeah. Would you waste 50% of the meat? I'm crazy for doing that. Tell me what do you think in the comments because this is real puzzling me. I don't know if recommended or not. I don't know if it's good. I mean, it's a great result. The taste is amazing. I cannot talk more about that. It's crazy good. But the process is the one that worries me a little bit. But I don't know. What do you guys think? Put it down there in the comments. Let yes. us know. Please let us know. All right. Now we stop talking about meat and we start talking about 
The shout out share. Ah, uh, yes. Yes. The shout out share. Let's go. <laughs> All right, we have Ooh. the shout out here. Here is my turn to shake. shake. I'm gonna teach you how to shake this. Take, 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 all right, we have one winner. Let's see who oh, we got here. Oh, shout out chair. Oh my god. Oh my god. goodness. This is a good one. Arodis Marzo. Arodis Marzo. A los cubanos de una suela en Ayalía, bro. Yo, Ayalía, yo. You are right there, bro. You can really come and try this steak right now, man. You are right there. People I mean, from Ayalía. Guys. In Hialeah, I love you guys. Thank Anything you. you can imagine, anything you need, you can find it in Hialeah. It's a unique Cuban place. I think it's the city where more people speak Spanish. It's 98% of the yeah. people speak Spanish, and it's amazing. It's full of Cubans, and love it's a it. lot of fun. So, so welcome to our table. Adonis, Adonis, it's Adonis or it's Adonis? Arodis. 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 <laughs> Arodis, bro. Come over here, see this chair. Eat all this meat because it's amazing and you're gonna love it. I know you're gonna love it, bro. I know you're gonna love it. <laughs> oh, so, guys, I mean, it was a lot of fun to do it. It broke my heart a few times doing a few things, but that's the only way you can test things and know if they work something to do it if they work if they don't work whatever you know that's the only way <laughs> of i mean course. <laughs> the results are amazing i love every single part of it i hate it the part that throws the meat away but that's what it is so this is like a love and hate relationship literally if you ask me i would do it again no <laughs> okay. i won't do it again it hurts my heart i mean it hurts my heart real hard guys you have no idea yeah but the final result is worth it freaking yeah, yeah bro oh, yeah. amazing it's, it's real good it's everything you imagine in what this thing was going to taste and look and feel in your mouth is you know when i have to do that i i, I didn't really like the vibe the video was getting throwing all that meat away and it really it really touched my fibers you know uh, you don't you guys don't know my story but believe me touch my fibers now okay um uh, once i put it out <laughs> put it on the table and started looking at it and everything i mean and then we try it i wasn't sure <laughs> until we tried it i know you I were kind sure. of upset when I he was, was doing that i was like Mm, what happened here? I was not upset, but I was concerned. I was concerned about, you know, doing this thing. But the results are amazing. So if you guys like it, please hit us with a like. Lots and lots of likes. If you want to know more than what we do here and you want to see more videos, subscribe to the channel. And don't forget to hit the bell so you will be notified every single Tuesday and Fridays when we all love our new videos. videos. <laughs> and if you have any comment, please, I know this video is going to bring a lot of comments. Oil. Please put it down there. Let me know what you think. I mean, it's, it's, the results are amazing, but I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. You're still doubting, but, yes. but be nice. Be nice, please. Don't crucify us. <laughs> <laughs> so that's all we got today for you guys. But remember that I love you. Mm, we love you and always try to be nice. See you next week. See you next week.